hardly know my mother. I don't need to. I know you. I watched you run circles around Bull. You've got that kick-ass thing. And you think it's genetic? Probably. It's like that thing in science, what you're born with or how you grow up. Nature versus nurture? I like biology. And it's smart, too. And beautiful. All around... Kick-ass. I was gonna say amazing. Oh, jeez, sorry. Oh, no. It's my dad. The hell? You're still talking about James. Well, it's kind of hard not to ever since he showed up in town and gave me something to compare you to. Well, I'm not James. Let me do me, okay? I wish you had done you instead of me and half the female population of Landview. Okay, how can I prove to you that I've changed? You can't. Because I'll never believe you. Just like I'll never buy that you weren't trying to save your own ass when Eli showed up. Of course I was trying to save my own ass. I didn't want to die, but Eli was threatening you too. And another thing? Why did Eli even set his sights on you in the first place? How did you wind up in a position where a killer wanted to come after you? Because... Because I found out about Eli's past. And I blackmailed him. Hey, are you okay? I have to go. What's wrong? Uh, it's a long story. I'll come with you. No, that's not a good idea. Air Star, it's not a good idea for me to let you go off alone when something bad obviously just happened. I'll be fine, James. You can be kick-ass and amazing and still need help from time to time. Thank you for talking me down. You're a really good friend, but this is something that I have to do on my own. Good, good luck studying. I knew this would happen. Knew what would happen? Well, the day she left, we, we had a talk. You know, the, the time right after I kicked your butt said, Money, honey. We talked, and she told me that you were going to hate her for leaving. And somehow she was okay with it. She said she knew I'd hate her, too. Typical mom. She didn't give a damn about how anyone else felt as long as she got her way. Well, she didn't care how most people felt, but she cared about us. Enough to make us hate her. Yeah, she didn't care if we hated her. Not if it might help keep us together after she was gone. Right, I hope she was wrong, then. Well, I hope the thing that keeps us together is something different. Something good. Her friends. By all means. Hungry? Thanks for coming. And for all that food. <laughs> Just, you know, want you to know you're not alone. And to remind you to eat. Well, you didn't have to do all that. Just seeing you, you're the best. Well, my brother paid for it all anyway. Which brother? Greg did. Oh, yeah, loser. Could you just not, Todd? Please. It's all right. I'm an understanding person, so I'll give your dad a free-to-be-a-jerk pass for a couple of days. He's grieving. And when people are grieving, they say things they don't mean. No, I meant it. Well, I mean this, too. I'm sorry for your loss, Mr. Manning. No, you stay. I'll get it. Even freak shows have feelings. Finally. I, I, I know this sounds bad. You let Eli run around town knowing he was a killer? I didn't know that at the time. You put all those people in danger just so you could get a payday? Okay, I, I didn't know it was that bad until later. And the money was going to be for James anyway. Oh, yeah, sure. Blame James. Okay, I understand maybe it's not the best move. 
But I saw a chance to get my brother from out from under my dad's thumb, and I took it. Now, maybe you don't understand this now that you live in a big, fancy mansion with the mayor and all our money, but James and I, we're all we've got. Oh, wait, I'm sorry. James has you, too. It's not true. Yeah? It could have fooled me the way you were draping yourself all over him. Oh, come on. Like, you didn't know that was all for show? I was just trying to make you jealous. It worked. It did not. It did? Can you see what you were doing to me? Honestly, I have no idea what's real with you and what's not. Okay, that's my fault. I, I treated you like crap, and I deserve everything you're ever going to do back to me, and probably more than that. You deserve somebody better. Somebody like Marco or James. Somebody who put you up on a pedestal. I don't want to do that. I want to learn. So, so sorry about Diane. She was so great to me, and I'm just gonna miss her so much. Yeah, me too. Whatever you need, I'm here. Thank you. You guys can go in if you want. Okay. I hope I didn't drag you away from anything important. It's just that I... I think Danny needs her sister. She's kind of in a bad way right now. Nothing could keep me away from here today. I'm trying hard not to think about it at all. Why? You know why. No. Tell me. You see, you're doing it again. Doing what? Being all nice. You're dangerous. Not anymore. Not to you. No, no, no. You are not going to trick me. Listen, no, I'm not trying to trick you. <sighs> then what exactly are you trying? Listen to me. I'm different now. <sighs> Yeah, you've said that before. I know, but this time it's true. So, what, you're asking me to trust you? I, I know I don't have any right to, but I promise it won't be like it was before. That's a promise. Because you've learned your lesson? That, and I, I know what I'm missing. And I'd do anything not to miss it anymore. Oh, yeah? Like what? Everybody's trying to fatten me up. <laughs> I'm sorry. I, I I wanted to help, but I was worried what would happen if I came over. I knew I'd say the wrong thing. No, it's okay. You don't have to say anything. You're helping just by being here. <laughs>